Good morning, my loves, and happy Monday. How are you guys day going? The holidays we just went through, and it was a lot. <laughs> so now I know it's recovery time for everybody, financially, mentally, just everything. You're trying to get yourself together for the New Year's, and it can definitely be done. It's time to declutter. It's time to really reset and get ready to take on every goal, every dream you ever had inside of you. It's time to go after it and it's time to really get it together. And I was walking in the um, store today and I know it's like, I'm, I can't be the only one who feel this way. Um, but sometimes I get, how can I say it? Not necessarily nervous, but I'm, I, I wanna explain it in the right way way i want to put it in in the right wording sometimes like when when i feel like a lot of people are staring at me or something like that i get anxious like anxiety and stuff like that and it's time to be comfortable in your own skin be comfortable in who you are and what god made you to be because god makes no mistakes and I know that's not always easy to do, but be confident in who you are and know that it's okay to be unique, it's okay to be different, it's okay to not be everybody cup of tea. But from this point forward, I've told myself no more feeling inadequate, no more feeling, you know, just like I'm not enough. I am enough. And God made no mistakes when he made me and I am proud of who I am and it's time to be confident in my skin and comfortable and know that I am unique, I am beautiful, and I am worthy as well. So let's prepare for the new year. Today I'm actually going to go out and pick up some items that I do need to create my vision board. And I'm thinking about doing it quite different. I'm not sure if I wanna actually do it at the house or if I wanna come out somewhere and do my vision board. But this year coming has to be a radical year. It has to be a radical year of change, a radical year of getting uncomfortable and knowing that in order to grow, you have to get uncomfortable. And I'm perfectly fine with that. And I hope that you guys join in with me and know that you are worthy. You are beautiful. You will live the life that you desire, but you have to put the work in. Faith without work is dead. And it's time to put action behind your goals and your plans. You got this. You could do this. It's, it's already in you. The greatness is there. You just have to release it. Know that you are. De declare over your life your affirmations. I am successful. I am wealthy. I am a six-figure earner. You have to declare these things over your life and you have to mean it. You have to believe it and you have to have faith that God is going to see it through for you. But you must believe and also pray the prayer that God aligns you with his will for your life and everything will fall into place. I love you guys and I will see you a little later when we go out to shop for our vision board. You guys know Didi's is my store and I actually saw this really cool idea that um, someone did with a vision board. So I'm thinking to go that route this year. I'll show you guys how I did it, you know, years prior, I will show you, but this year I think I'm going to take a different approach. So I'm um, excited to share that with you guys. And I hope that you stay tuned for this video. If you are new here, welcome. If you're not new here, welcome back since you know it's nothing but love. If you have not subscribed to my channel yet, please. Why did I just have a brain fart? <laughs> please consider subscribing to our channel. Um, I love you guys. Over here is, is all inspiration, motivation, day in the life, self-care, love, everything surrounding love, God, and family. That's what my channel is about. And I also do shop with me. So we have fun over here as well. But I love you guys and I'll see you soon.
guys, I got everything that I went into Five Antelope for, and I was able to get everything that I needed. I actually put the hawk back because I'm not about to pay $5 for no mask, but what he don't know won't hurt him. He don't know about it, so he'll be okay. But I got the I am back home from running my areas, doing what I need to do, and I would like to show you, share with you guys everything that I did pick up today. So... Was over there so i did go a few places i showed you guys that i did go to diddy's to pick up something that i need to work on my vision board for the near the year to come as well as five and below i believe and a few other places i went but i really want to show you guys what i picked up from diddy's so I actually watched a vision board video and um, it happened to be one of the people that I do enjoy to watch on YouTube, which is Chelsea Janae. And I really love her content. You guys check her out. She's an awesome YouTuber. She just relocated to Atlanta, Georgia, and she's doing her thing. Like she's really bossed up. So um, I did pick up this sketchbook. And I know it might be too much for some people liking. It was $5.99, but I absolutely love it. And I'm going to tell you guys why. So, I don't know if you guys can really see this picture, but it is a picture of Paris. And it has like a bus. And it's just a sketch of Paris and things like that. And it just reminds me of like travel. And I do desire to travel and when I saw this picture, in my mind, it automatically went to the realm of going places. Because I do live in Miami, and that's a part of Florida. And seeing this picture of a different place, it just put me in the mind frame of going places. And I really like that because anytime that I do a vision board, it's because I want to go to new places. And I want to experience new things on a different level. So I just thought this was perfect for what I was trying to do with it. Now, I will show you guys a sample of what I did before with my vision board in a moment. But I'm going to um, show you what exactly I'm going to do with this book right here. So basically, this is just a sketchbook and all the pages are empty. So what I am going to do is put 2022 really big and then... This will be my vision board, but it's going to be in the strapbook form. So every year until it's filled up, my vision board will be placed in here and it will give me an opportunity to reflect and look back at my growth and everything that I have accomplished in one place. So I absolutely love that idea and I am going to adopt it for myself. I also have some magazines. I have three magazines that I will be using to go through and pick out different little, you know, things that resonate with me to add to my vision book, vision board. So I will be utilizing these magazines. Also picked up these um, gel pens. It's just different colored gel pens that I could write little things or draw with them. And this was actually $149 at DD's discount. I love DDs. You guys know that by now. You cannot beat that. Now, I am going to show you guys a few more to five and below today. And from five and below, I did pick up this tripod stand. So this was five dollars, and it's actually what I'm using now. So if you guys like the way that the setup looks, comment below and let me know how you feel about the setup because I'm actually using this right now so yeah that's that now as you guys know i just came back from a family trip for the holidays and my beautiful plant here next to me went three days without water so um although she is growing and flourishing i'm noticing that her brown area has gotten a bit more browner and i really want to prevent it from um, getting any more damage so I am going to fertilize her and I'm going to show you guys exactly how I fertilize her I love greenery I love plants and I actually have a really huge aloe plant in my backyard and then I have three smaller aloe, aloe plants so I have a total 
a four aloe plant so i did go out today and i cut a piece of aloe and i'm going to show you guys what that looked like so i just chopped it up as like so can you guys see it i know it looks really slimy but it's just aloe so i chopped it up like this and i am going to fertilize my plant with with the aloe and i'm going to show you guys exactly how let me, let me see 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 the, that's just the slime from the aloe but i chopped it up in these fine little pieces like this and i am going to fertilize her with it and then i am going to water her so i'm going to show you guys exactly how i do that sorry my face is cut off right now um so one more thing i am going to show you guys before i fertilize my plant is my very first vision board and i'm so so sorry for the angle of my face you guys can barely see me now my very first vision board is huge because I did do it in the photo, photo frame, and this is my baby. So I am about to show you guys the um, way my very, very first, like the first time ever I've ever did a vision board. This is how she looks. So I am gonna share it with you guys. So this is her. So yeah, you guys, this was my very first vision board and just to give you a gist of what i have on here i have keep god first and this is a time when i was really working on myself as far as self-love and things like that so i have a lot of things dealing with self-love and being positive and just affirming in myself that i am beautiful i am loved family means a lot to me like things like that so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this portion of the video. If you have not yet, please consider um, subscribing to my channel. And now I'm going to show you guys how I fertilize my plant. As you guys can see here is where I'm having the problem area with my plant I have a lot of browning going on here so basically what I am going to do I place these little planter sticks that's what I call them but I place them here and that just shows me where exactly I fertilize the soil at and basically the what I use for fertilizer is aloe excuse the little net but it's a part of having plants so basically i'm gonna take it out and just use my fingers as so i grab a piece of the aloe and then i put it in the soil and then i just cover it up i push it down a bit I know exactly where
I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, please like, enjoy it. Please like, comment, and if you have not already subscribed to our channel, it will be a pleasure to have you as a part of the family. And I really do appreciate all the love, the support, the comments, the likes. I appreciate all of you. And until next time, my loves. You are beautiful and worthy of living the life you deserve. Thanks for watching, sis. Until next time.